Breaking news, England versus Russia, the chemical attack, 36 hour deadline, and NATO's Article 5. This is Throttle Up Prepper. Breaking news, England versus Russia, the chemical attack, Article 5 in NATO, the brink of war. Maybe, maybe not. This is Darla Prepper. Welcome to the program. Uh, hello to all of my new subscribers. Thanks for uh, joining us here. And uh, for all of you who have been around a while, thanks for sticking around. Please uh, stay all the way to the end and uh, check out uh, some great other uh, videos that we've put up that we'll link to, as well as our Patreon account. Uh, we're looking for uh, some support so we can keep on doing what we're doing. Uh, also, uh, we'd love to have you stop by the website, throttleupprepper.com. Got to wipe the eye. I'm getting a little misty over here. Uh, listen, so you probably heard it's been kind of uh, obscure in the, in the news here uh, the past week since... Uh, Clearly a Russian chemical attack on England soil, um, trying to apparently take out a, a rogue Russian spy or two, and in the process, uh, 21 England uh, English citizens are in the hospital, uh, many in uh, critical condition from what I understand. I don't know if there's been any, uh, any have succumbed to their injuries. But it is not good. Theresa May, and which just kind of becoming a thing today, uh, at least on certain radio uh, programs nationally, that uh, I guess Donald Trump traveling out to California today is going to be talking with Prime Minister uh, Theresa May uh, this afternoon uh, about the response. Uh, she is demanding a 36-hour uh, response and accounting, if you will, from Russia, which uh, expires tomorrow. Not sure exactly what time tomorrow, Wednesday this week. Uh, and uh, wow, it's kind of dicey. We got a three-way confrontation at the at the least. Uh, nuclear armed nations. Uh, of course, nobody wants war on either side. Uh, I think Sting put it best. The Russians love their children too. It would be a terribly uh, silly thing to do. So um, at any rate. What's happening? Are you prepared? Are you watching this? Are you, are you uh, aware? I can't believe I wasn't even. I kind of heard something in the background. It wasn't. Uh, they weren't making a big thing about it. I, like I said, until today. Uh, so you know, it's kind of odd timing. You know, uh, shake up at the State Department today. Rex Tillerson is out. Uh, Mike Pompeo is in. Uh, he's a hardliner against uh, Russia. He is no fan of Russia. He's pretty uh, hardcore uh, that way. Uh, former head of the CIA, uh, good guy from all accounts, a patriot. Uh, Maybe a good move, but uh, also, what was it, last week or the week before, Russia releasing those videos of the new hypersonic alleged uh, missile system that they have that uh, allegedly can defeat our uh, defenses. And, of course, we say nay, nay. Uh, so what are you thinking? Are you watching this? Are you prepping? Are you concerned? Are you not concerned? <laughs> you smell a false flag brewing. I don't know. What's going on? I'm interested to see what uh, our buddy uh, Vladimir Putin has to say about this. I wonder if there will be uh, any official statement from Russia or uh, a continued thumbing of the news at the West. Uh, I don't know. I'm interested to see what your uh, thoughts are, especially those of you in the UK, like Prepper Vet UK. That's right. I'm calling you up, brother. Uh, what, what's your perspective? What's the news like uh, over there? Uh, ground zero, if you will. Uh, hopefully you are safe and sound and nowhere near uh, what happened, uh, but hopefully you've got a good take on it. And uh, actually, when I get done recording this, I'm going over to check out your channel. And uh, if you're watching this video here, I suggest you go over to Prepper Vet UK's channel as well and uh, see if you already have something posted. So uh, anyway, uh, until next time, and it's definitely time for all of us to throttle up uh, be prepared for whatever comes our way, please stop by our Patreon page. Uh, the card should be up and uh, support us so we can keep on doing what we're doing. God bless.